And coming up next, our main event, a matchup for the UFC middleweight division title. You ready? Are right, you ready? Oh, All right, so here we go with this UFC middleweight championship. Oh! Oh, big left! and a great performance by this young man. All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight. And now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliata calls a stop to this contest at 21 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC middleweight.
And coming up next, our main event, a matchup for the UFC middleweight division title. So here he is, weight contender getting set for this 185 pound title fight. He believes this title shot should have come a long time ago. But he has let bygones be bygones. The focus now, unseating the champion in dominant fashion and starting a new middleweight legacy of his own. 25 minutes or fewer away from becoming the new champion. We will see how he performs tonight. All right, so here we go with this UFC middleweight championship fight. The round one clock is starting to tick. The number one contender believes the champ is ripe for the picking. The champion has heard that noise in the past, and he has dismissed all challengers. See, you don't understand. After you take a head kick like this, that is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Back to the feet. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this time. Big kick land. Nice head kick. Oh! He went high on that one. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. the guard as another head kick lands. One more here, DC, and we could... Oh! Who's hurt? Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, big left. Wow! He's out! It's over. It's over. <laughs> yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew... ...and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of... All right, the official decision is in. Here once more, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliato has called a stop to this contest. At two minutes, 17 seconds of the very first round. You ready? You ready? All right, so here we go with round one of this UFC middleweight championship fight. The consensus number one. Oh! And now he lands a combination. Oh! Oh, man. This ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA, and he's as good as it gets. The problem is the opponent is not controlling his posture. He's allowing his opponent to get up, and when he does, he creates this piece of faith. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he that ended the fight. All right, we go back inside the octagon to the veteran voice once more. He is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliata has called a stop to this contest at 45 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC middleweight champion of the world, Cliff Mamba. All right, so 
there he is, the still UFC middleweight champion of the world. He And build it up again. Tell him I burn it down twice just for the fun of it. Tell him so much money I don't know what to do with it. Tell him I don't pick up my phone, ain't knowing what the time. Tell him I got me one gun and an alibi. Tell him so much love that the whole thing feel like a lie. I don't need nobody. 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 Still dangerous, goodness gracious, move like the Gracie brother. Still hate me something, fed everybody, they don't save me nothing. Still back to the bone from fetus, that man move misleading. Choco, check if he's breathing. Nudge, but don't think he's breathing. Bully bop, them weave, man leaning. Last man that tried their beacon, don't talk too much, no more speaking. Man, pre man, man, man still scheming. No threats to protect my cleaners, creep them, beat it, catch man sleeping. So the beefing thing's not needed, but I had big, big man turn Jesus. And coming up next, our main event, a matchup for the UFC middleweight division title. So here we go with round one of this UFC middleweight championship fight. The consensus number one and number two. Whoa! Oh! Cute shot there. Oh, he might be out. And now he lands a combination. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad. Here. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. He took that whole kick. Yeah. Oh, he might be out. Keep your hands up. Use your now. Oh! Nice one-two there. His misses are entertaining. Oh, wow! that body is.
Again, the winner here was so aggressive with his onslaught that ultimately appeared as though the outcome was an eventuality. So if you're the referee, you got to protect the fighter. And I thought he did a good job of doing just that. Well, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched glove. I mean, a competitive fight. That one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed. In Here we go inside the octagon for the official decision to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest. At two minutes, seven seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC middleweight champion of I'm still wins, wins, got me in that mood. How they hit me when they know they done it too. How they hit me because they know I got the juice. Uh-huh. They like oh, they watch and I'm For a battery, blowing all these ones look like we hit the lottery. My OG just hit me up, he told me that he proud of me. Always going hard, a lot of people that count on me. Always in the studio, and that's increasing my salary. I remember I was young when they hated it. Up with my name on the property, and now we don't care what it costs. I started you here to exhaust, smoking cushy. You made it, you got it looking like a boss. I'm getting all these packs and got enough face on my wall. Diamonds dripping like a faucet. Big bag, I want a big if it ain't getting money, you can skip that. Big bag, I want a big bag. Put you in a two-seater, let you kick back. I'm still whiz. Still whiz. Got me in that mood. How they hit it when they know that I'm that dude. I hear they hit it because they know I got the juice. Uh-huh. They like, oh, They watching how I move. They be acting like we cool. You thought this was, I ain't no fool. Still park the whip and chill, still never popping pills, still got a many bills, still give them chills, still hundred dollar bills, had a crib in the hills, one hide, fall asleep and still making sales, one hand on the wheel, couple bands on the mill, playing on the field, weight on the scale, in the air for 20 hours, I was unavailable, seen how much I'm worth, started thinking I was dateable, all my getting rich dudes, I done paid a few, smoking weed by the zip, millions, I done made a few, stick the stamp, stacking up and stay want a big bag if it ain't getting money you can skip that big bag i want a big bag put you in a rolls royce let you kick back i'm still with got me in that mood how they hate it when they know that I'm i want to see your skills right now let's get in there and push Hey, hey, I can see you're frustrated, but I saw some things that we can improve on. And coming up next, our main event, a matchup for the UFC middleweight division title.
All right, so here we go with this UFC Middleweight Championship fight. The round one clock is starting to tick. The number one contender believes the champ is right for the picking. Whoa! Oh, oh! He oh. didn't like that left hand. Oh! Uppercut lands for him. Oh! Massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Wow! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. ground with this guy. And he switches his stance yet again. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right Again, the winner here was so aggressive with his onslaught. He wanted to make sure he kept the judges out of the equation. Mission accomplished on that front as he gets the TKO victory here tonight. All right, let's re-rack the highlight now, DC. And he's certainly going to enjoy watching this one back. The head kick was there early. It was there often and ultimately ended the night for his opponent. He found a weakness in his opponent's game. The left kick. Over and over, he was able to land it. And he was... Right here now, Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at 1 minute, 36 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC middleweight champion of the world. Still the king of the one. And coming up next, our main event, a matchup for the UFC middleweight division title. Best fighters on this UFC roster, top to bottom, to have never realized a piece of UFC gold. Former Ultimate Fighter winner Kelvin Gastelum, and some of you like to say embrace the grind. He has absolutely embraced it. He's embraced the sprints. Seems to have this champion's mentality, and 
he'll try to parlay that into another big win here tonight. And he's going to need that mentality in order to build himself back to where he wants to be. But couple that mentality. You ready to fight? All right, so here we go with round one of this UFC middleweight championship fight. The consensus number one and whoa! as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the time. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Oh, he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, straight right. Big hook. in a single collar tie. It's very tricky. Oh. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. We'll finish this fight. Gasol gets up, but the question is for how long he looks wobbly. All right, great position for him here. He's got the full mount. Let's see if he can get that ground pound. Oh, he's got to get it going, but he can't rush. A lot of times, guys get in the full mount, and they rush, and they get nervous. They're like, oh my goodness, I'm winning. The reality is, you're winning, but it can change in a... Whoa! Making all these shots count. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, absolutely one for the highlight reel right there. A tremendous kick to spell the end of the night for his opponent, and for him, I should say, but just caught him flush, full force, beautiful extension on the kick, and... The fight was really over as soon as that one made contact. I'm not even sure he was conscious when he hit the canvas. Outstanding performance here tonight. We sent it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 27 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC middleweight champion of the world, Flint Mamba. All right, so off the record, you'd like the champion to get it done tonight, and that is how it played out, and still UFC middleweight champion. Congratulations, Arnold. It makes you feel like you know what you're talking about. When in reality, you don't. But this guy makes me feel like a professional because it's hard to bet against him. Congratulations once again, champ. Too humble. <laughs> Too humble.
With that real hip hop ad, bring it back. Sacrificing the genre to make a couple dollars. Label who the least to change is just the back of the column. Come on.